Up next on Running, the program that showcases athletes in action. Over seven miles with no level sections. Around every bend, another uphill. The Northeast Delta Dental Mount Washington Road Race. A test of your grit and fitness level, and you'll know in the first mile. Wounded veterans are first off the line in the Achilles International Hope and Possibility 5 Mile in Central Park. Achilles encourages the disabled, regardless of the affliction, to participate in mainstream events. After the horn sounds, it's all heart. No smoke and mirrors here. What you see is what you get in the Tri-State Spartan Race in Tuxedo, New York. Barbed wire and mud are the easy part. Get dirty and wet, then warm up over a nice, cozy fire. One if by land, two if by sea, as long as you get to a starting line in the Shelter Island 10K or 5K. A circuit of the island with lots of fresh air and community tributes get you to a welcome finish line where all celebrate the freedom to run. A quick look at some of the top big city marathons to add to your expanding running resume. Early November, it's TCS New York, a must do at least once. Join the First Avenue party. Then February, the Los Angeles Marathon, a good reason to visit the West Coast and make some new friends. Boston in April, with its qualifying standards, is a lifetime goal for serious runners. May brings the Dick's Sporting Goods Pittsburgh Marathon. Many rivers to cross in this downtown celebration. A special running series feature, Sweat in the City. To Bergen County in New Jersey for a visit with Soul in Motion Floating Yoga. The extra level of balance required amplifies the yoga experience. In February of next year, the U.S. Olympic Marathon Trials will be held in Los Angeles. One of the favorites is Skechers athlete Meb Kofleski, who four years earlier won the trials. At stake this time, a trip to the 2016 Olympic Games in Rio. I'll be happy to go to Rio and represent our country the best I can. Why not? Mix a little fitness with some Apre Run wine tasting at Alba Vineyard in western New Jersey in the Grape Gallop. For most, the run comes first, then the wine. 